this question was asked by IIT JWE Advanced in the year 2023 and this is question number 11. The question is the value of a for this equation integral 0 to x t square minus i t plus 13 whole dt equals to x into sin a by x. Here e is here. Okay. As a solution is or r, so we have four options. Okay. After looking at these equations, most of the people must be wanting to apply Leibniz rule. Left hand side is okay. You can see over here in the right hand side, you have two functions over here. Here we have x as well as sin a by x. For this, we have to apply product rule, okay, u into v rule. So here, if you apply product rule over here, x into sine of a by x. Now, if you differentiate sine, you will get cos a by x. Again, you have to differentiate this a by x again with respect to x. So it's somehow complicated, okay. What I will do is, I will directly integrate it, okay, and let's see how it works. So, solution. So, let's integrate this directly. On the left hand side, here I will get t cube, t cube by 3 minus 8 t square by 2 plus 13 t and limit is from 0 to x and on the, on the right hand side what do we have x into sine of a by x okay now let's substitute over here if i substitute it will become x cube by 3 minus let's cancel 4 x square plus 13 x is equals to x into sine of a by x okay look at here we have sine of a by x okay here x should not be here, here x should not be equal to 0, okay. So, if x is equal to 0, then it's undefined, okay. So, since x is not equal to 0, so we can take x common over here and then x and this x we can get cancelled, okay. So, if I am taking x common over here, it implies, if I take x common, then x square upon 3 minus 4x plus 13 is equals to x into sine of a by x okay so this x and this x gets cancelled since x is not equal to 0 and then let's make x square coefficient free so i am taking 1 by 3 common so x square minus 12x plus 3 9 is equals to sine of a by x okay e is equals to, is implies 1 by 3, let's make perfect square, here x square minus twice 6, twice x into 6, okay, here x into 6 is 12, okay, plus 6, 6 is 36, 6 square we need, 36 plus 3 is 39, is equals to sine of a by x, okay, so, is implies 1 by 3, this from here to here it become x minus 6 the whole square x minus 6 the whole square and then plus 3 is equals to sine of a by x okay now let's say this 1 by 3 inside x minus 6 upon x minus 6 the whole square upon 3 plus 1 is equals to sine of a by x now look at here, okay. Now this term, since x minus 6 the whole space here, so this term should be carried 0, okay. Now again we have plus 1 over here, okay. Therefore the whole this term should be greater than 1, okay. We know that the, the range of sine is minus 1 to 1, okay. And then here this is greater than 1, okay. So now here is greater than 1, okay. Therefore, therefore on the left hand side, Okay, here x minus 6 it should be equals to 0. Okay, it means x equals to 6 over here. And then from the right hand side, when x equals to 6, what we have sine of a by 6 equals to 1. Therefore, a by 6 equals to 4n plus 1 into pi by 2. So, if I can sell this to become 3, it will become 3. Therefore, it implies a equals to, if I send this, 3 into 4n plus 1. 
into pi okay for this n okay see n should be integer okay it may be minus or it may be plus or it may be zero okay so when n equals to integer the the possibility is become this and this okay these two are the fraction okay now when when n equals to zero okay this becomes zero okay therefore a become three pi okay so this is the possibilities they are asking is or r okay so and then when this is not these are two are fraction okay so when n equals to minus one let's see when n equals to minus one then a equals to three into here minus four plus one into pi it means here minus minus nine pi okay so these two are the possible values for these equations okay thank you